It's a new year and that means all new products. I spent the past three months with the brand new cat. Here's how it stacks up. First, let's talk features. The cat has three modes, sleep, wake, and completely bonkers. Sleep mode not only saves the most battery life, but it actually recharges the battery as well. In sleep mode, you can't access any other functions, so unfortunately, it's only useful when your cat's battery is low. Wake is the mode you'll keep your cat in most. In wake mode, it can play, cuddle, eat, all the things we've come to expect from previous models. In completely bonkers mode, the cat will go absolutely nuts, jumping onto and banking off of anything and everything in sight. Once in completely bonkers mode, there is no way to switch it back to normal wake mode until it does so itself, which depending on how you look at it, could be a design flaw or great entertainment. Speaking of design, the cat is designed by God himself, who already has a history of great design as we've seen in previous products, such as the Sagia antelope, the blobfish, and the red lip batfish. And the cat is no exception. At roughly 7 inches thick, it's not the thinnest cat we've ever seen, but certainly not the thickest either. That, paired with a height of about 14 inches, means it can fit into almost any nook or cranny. Though whether it can fit or not won't stop it from trying. The cat comes with an optional case that you can put it in for protection. I found that I don't prefer the case though since it's not a perfect fit and my cat wouldn't stay in it 100% of the time. With or without the case, it can be difficult to hold in your hand. I couldn't find a great way to hold it without it slipping out of my grip. Now with other products last year, bending was a real concern. During our tests, while there was some obvious bending going on, there didn't seem to be any structural or cosmetic damage. And it did great in our drop test as well, with no obvious damage after the drop. Water resistance, however, was a different story. It only lasted a few seconds once we had submerged it in water. Now the cost of the cat does vary wildly depending on where you go. I was able to snag this one for just over $100. Then there's a subscription fee. $25 a month will get you food and litter for the waste management system. When all's said and done, it's a pretty great deal. In spite of its shortcomings, I think it's a great product and could easily become one of the best of 2016.